Hi guys, welcome to my channel. My name is Olena and in this video I'm going to tell you about the difference between error, mistake, defect, bug, fault, problem and failure. In ICKP there are several terms like error, bug, failure, which can be similar from the first few, but there is a difference between them. Questions about these terms are very popular on ICKB exam, so it is important to know the definitions. Contact of this video. ICKB definitions. Flow. Example of error, defect and failure. Causes of errors. And sample questions. According to ICKB glossary, error, synonym is mistake, is a human action then produces an incorrect result. Synonyms for defect are bug, fault, problem, is a flaw in a component or system that can cause the component or system to fail to perform its required functions. For example, an incorrect statement or data definition. A defect is encountered during execution may cause a failure on the component or system. Failure is a deviation of the component or system from its expected delivery, service or result. The flow. First error occurs. Then defect occurs. When there is error, there will be defect for sure. But when there is defect, then may be failure, but it is not a must. Not all defects can result into failures. The defect, the defect causes failure only when special conditions occur and code with defect is executed. Failure is always noticeable. Here is example. Imagine help module in mobile app. There is a text field where a user can type a question and get, get an answer. A developer made an error and a comma is not accepted by the system. So there is a defect in the system. User can type a question with comma and without comma. When there is a comma in the question, the system crashes. So in this case, the defect, which is comma is not accepted, will cause failure, which is crash of the application. And it can happen that user will never use comma in their questions. In this case, the failure can never arise. So there are two scenarios. First one, when user will never use a comma in his questions. The next one is when user uses comma in his question. In the first scenario, the system works fine. There is no crash, nothing. The system retrieves the answer to the question and there is no failure. During the second scenario, user uses comma in his question and there is a defect when um, comma is used, system crashes. So there is a failure. We can see it is visible. Crash is visible and noticeable for the user, so it is a failure. So, in second variant, there is a failure. Not only programmers can make errors. Errors can, can be made by technical writers, business analysts, designers and other human beings who are involved in software development process. Causes of errors. Interruption during work, fatigue, time pressure, lack of experience, misunderstanding, complex systems, complex code, changing technologies, system interactions, environmental conditions. So now we are going to answer several sample questions. I recommend you to pause the video, try to answer these questions by yourself and then verify the result. So the first question is following. Below is a list of problems that can be observed during testing or in production. Which one of these problems is a failure? 
So we know that failure is usually noticeable or visible to the end user. So let's see the answer set. The product crashed when the user selected an option in a dialog box. So it's obviously a failure. Next, one source code file included in the build had the false version. It is a defect, but it can cause a failure or not. So it's not a failure. Next one, the computation algorithm used false input variables. It is the same. This code can be never executed, so it's not a failure. The next one, the developer misinterpret the requirement for the algorithm. So developer made an error which lead to defect, but there is there is no failure in this example. So the correct answer to this question is A. The product crashed when the user selected an option in a dialog box. The second question. What stands for human action that produces an incorrect result? And this question is a Roman type of question, so we should select a correct answer. We know that a human action that produces an incorrect result is an error and the synonym of it is a mistake. So the correct answer is first and third. We should take a look and find it in the answer set. So D. First and third are true. Other are false. Next question. Select true statement. All defects lead to failures. You know that it's not true. Not all defects lead to failures. And we, we had an example. Mistakes can be done only by developers. No, it's not true. We know that all human beings who are involved in software development process can make mistakes. Errors can't be caused due to time pressure. No, we know that time pressure can cause errors. Next one. Not all defects lead to failures. Yeah, we know that. Not all defects lead to failures. That's the correct answer. Fourth question. According to the ISTQB glossary, the word defect is synonymous with which of the following words? Bug, error, failure, mistake. We know that defect has the synonyms like bug, fault and problem. So here there is a bug. There is no fault and problem. So A, the correct answer. Thank you for watching. You can find other ICQB tutorials on my channel. If you are interested in software testing related videos, please subscribe. See you in my next videos.